Nations and Empires is a game by Scott Stark. It's an expansive historical strategy game. We'll rebox it here today on Legendary Tactics. So this game comes jam-packed with tokens. We've got military tokens, nukes, economy tokens, and science tokens. There's also the blue tokens, our civil liberties tokens. To store your game, it's best if you return all of the counters back to the punch outs. You'll need all the reference cards in the game. The font is tiny, but they're absolutely necessary. Other cards you've got will allow you to build buildings, hospitals, factories. Uh, you also have powers that you can use throughout the game, espionage, assassination. You also get scientists, a variety of them, with no special powers, but they do gather science over time, just jam them back into the shrink wrap. Each nation that you use can have one scientist in it, and the nations all have variable player powers that give you certain bonuses. It's best if you can get the leader that matches up with each nation, but you don't absolutely need to do that way. So throughout the game, you'll be gathering all of these different tokens to try to expand your empire and either outcompete your opponents or destroy them utterly. We'll be putting a playthrough out on the game very shortly. So slam those nation cards back into the plastic, turn it to the box. We can check out some of the other scientists. There's a wide variety of characters in the game. The artwork is really well done. The leaders are the backbone of the game. Each of them have different bonuses that they'll give you, different costs. And at the bottom, they've got the circles, which are their special abilities. You will need to learn those abilities if you want to succeed at this game. And there are a variety of different leaders from different time periods. All of the dice are used to roll in the game or to track how long a leader's been in power. Overall, you'll have fun with your leaders, building iconic structures, creating agreements with various players at the table, and choosing your strategy in the game. You might be a peaceful leader, or perhaps you'll be a conqueror. The choice is yours. So that's how you rebox nations and empires.